Last time on How Railways Work, we discussed AWS, Advanced Warning Systems. Today, we will look at the other system in use on modern railways. Developed in the 90s by British Rail and its successor Railtrack, Train Protection and Warning Systems, or TPWS, came about to replace automatic train protection, which had a few flaws. The idea being that when a train passes a signal at red, known as SPAD, or signal passed at danger, the system would automatically engage the brakes on the trains. With nationwide rollout of the system in the early 2000s thanks to the Railway Safety Regulations of 1999. The system is very basic. There will be a set of grids on the track at the signal and a predetermined distance in front of the signal based on line speed and gradient. When the signal is set to danger, the first grid is energised. When the train passes over the grid, it begins a timer inside the engine's onboard receiver. If the engine then passes over the second grid at the signal before the timer has run out, the brakes are applied and the train is brought to a stop as it has passed the signal at danger. The driver will then need to reset the system and speak to the signalman. The driver also has access to an override button. This allows them to pass signals at danger when authorised, such as going to rescue a stranded engine. The NWR does actually use this system in Sodor Chronicles, and the engines have all been retrofitted to include TPWS.